Greetings, child. I've met few aside from goblins here. You recognize the Scourge. This man is a follower of Leviata, goddess of pain. Ah, are you also here to assist with the prisoner? I was invited to teach them some of my techniques. I live for pain and its intricacies, you see. But alas, these goblins seem to thrive on the crude and primitive. Pain without purpose is a terrible thing. Wouldn't you agree? You know the Maiden of Pain. How refreshing. But there is more to us than that. Yes, we worship her through pain, often our own, but it is an intimate and loving thing, one we offer up. If you would permit it, I can show you firsthand. By all means, let us see what his skilled hand might get up to. Oh, I have something exquisite in mind. Both Loviatar and I are interested in how you handle pain, dear one. And should you delight her, you will most assuredly receive her most gracious blessing. Trust me. Simply face the wall, and we can begin. Yes, this will do nicely. <laughs> The pain you suffer will cleanse you. Do not fight it. Your voice sounds so sweet, dear one. Keep going. Would you have joined up with her if you'd known she'd be indulging in this sort of thing, Astarian? I mean, I had my hopes. Pain is proof that we live. Revel in it. That's it! Do one! Let Loviata hear you! My, my. Who knew our friend had so much blood in them? Better not let too much be spilled. As much as I'm enjoying the show, we may still need her afterwards. Sweet child, you bore the pain like a true believer. I am proud to have served you this penance. Oh, as did I. Dear one, Loviata herself found your performance inspiring. She has deemed you worthy of her blessing. And on a personal note, that was positively divine. Your world has strange customs. Don't group me with the likes of them. True, you wouldn't have the grit 